Hey guys, I have here my JBL Vibe 300 Truly Wireless Earbuds and in this video I want to explain to you how to pair these earbuds to your Windows computer. So this can be as in this example here with a laptop or it works the same way also for a desktop. Now we start out by bringing the earbuds into the Bluetooth pairing mode and we do that by simply removing one of the earbuds out of the charging case and then we're going to take a look at the LED here on the side of it. So in case you've never paired your earbuds before with anything, then this is just going to start blinking in blue relatively rapidly, just like this here. If you have paired these earbuds before, for example with your smartphone, then you have to manually bring the earbuds into the pairing mode. And we do that by first touching the touch sensor here on the side, where it says JBL. We're going to touch that once, and then we're going to touch and hold it for more than five seconds. See, so we touch it and then we touch and hold. And then a couple of seconds later, you should see the blue LED blinking here on the side. Okay, so this was already it for the earbud. We can now place this to the side. Just make sure not to put it back into the charging case at this point. And now we're going to switch over to our computer. And here we are going to take a look at the lower right corner of the screen. That's where we see here this little up arrow to show the hidden icons and there we should find this blue Bluetooth icon. So we're going to click right on that and you're going to find here the option to add a Bluetooth device. And once we click on that, we're going to load up the uh, setting screen for Bluetooth. Now in case you do not find that Bluetooth icon in the lower right corner, then you can also use the search bar and just type in Bluetooth there and you will find Bluetooth and other device settings. So this is what we want to select and it's going to take us to the exact same screen. Now the first thing we have to do here is we're going to check if Bluetooth is enabled. And you see here Bluetooth right now for me is turned on, so this is okay. If yours is turned off, this is now the time to turn Bluetooth on. And now on the very top of the screen, we see here add Bluetooth device. So we are going to select that and this will bring up a new pop-up. And the first list item here is Bluetooth to add mice, keyboards, pens, and audio. Oh, audio. So this is what we want to select. And now the computer is going to search for new Bluetooth devices. The first one says unknown device, so we never want to click on that because we don't know what it is. But here we find our JBL Vibe 300 TWS. So we're going to select this and now the computer is going to pair with our earbuds. And a couple of seconds later, it's going to show us all the features that these earbuds provide. So here it says we can use voice and music. So we can use these earbuds as a microphone. And in theory, you should at this point be able to use the earbuds to uh, listen to music and also for phone conversations. In case one of those features does not work for you, then you type in sound here in the uh, search bar and you find sound playback options. So we're going to select this. And in the following screen, we have here the output device that we can select. And uh, we have two options for the earbuds. One is stereo and one is hands-free. In case you're not planning on using the microphone at all, then I suggest you select the stereo option. Otherwise, use the hands-free. And now in order to make the microphone work, we scroll down a little bit and we find here input devices. And here we also can find the JBL Vibe 300 hands-free. We're going to select this. And at this point, the computer should use our earbuds as the microphone, so as the audio input device. Okay, so now our earbuds are ready to be used. You can, of course, also use the second one at the same time. And now just one more thing when you're considering to use the earbuds with your computer in the future. So in case you do also pair these earbuds with your smartphone, then it is possible that sometimes your earbuds just won't connect with your laptop because in that case, they are most likely already connected to your smartphone. In this case, turn off the Bluetooth functionally on your smartphone and then try to connect the earbuds again with your computer. And also, of course, vice versa. So in case they don't connect with your smartphone, make sure the earbuds are not already connected to the computer. Okay, so this was already it. I hope you found this video helpful. And if you have any more questions or comments, then please leave a message below.